Begin by letting yourself breathe deeply and fully, allowing your breath to come more deeply into your belly, if that is comfortable for you. And let every out breath be a releasing, letting go kind of breath. Just invite your body, mind, and spirit to release any tension they don't need to hold. And notice that with each breath you take, you breathe in fresh oxygen and energy that flows through your body and mind, beginning to renew and refresh them, cleansing and energizing. And every breath you release can allow you to relax a bit more, like a balloon deflating Letting yourself relax, letting the tension out of your body. As you start to relax more deeply, you might notice that from time to time, you can hear sounds from the environment around you. If anyone needs to get your attention for something important, they can address you directly and you can open your eyes, fully alert, bringing your complete attention to them and responding if need be. Otherwise, just notice that sounds, voices, or other things going on around you are really not important to your purpose right now. Your purpose is to relax to let go of stress you don't need to hold on to, and to come to better terms with the many feelings you are experiencing. And so you can let any outside sounds remain out in the background of your awareness, and allow yourself to move to an even deeper level of relaxation and comfort. And to help you relax your body even more deeply and comfortably, let your breathing once again become natural and regular and easy. And begin to relax even more deeply by simply closing your eyes and bringing your attention to your feet and ankles. And invite your feet and ankles to soften and relax. And notice how they respond allow them to continue to relax more deeply in their own way, releasing any tension that they don't need to hold. Now, become aware of the muscles of your shins and calves, all the muscles of your lower legs, and notice how they feel. And simply invite your shins and calves and lower legs to relax. Notice what you sense or feel in your legs as they begin to relax in their own way. Without worrying or struggling to relax. Just inviting and allowing your legs to move to a deeper and more comfortable state of being. In the same way, notice now your knees and invite your knees to soften and relax. Notice the muscles of your upper legs, thighs and hamstrings, the front and back of your upper legs, inviting them to soften, to relax and to release any tension they don't need to have. You don't need to worry about what they need to have and what they don't need to have. Just invite your knees and legs to continue to relax in their own way. Now, 
Notice your hips and pelvis, inviting your hips and pelvis, your low back and buttocks to soften and relax, releasing any tension your body doesn't need to hold in those areas, and allowing the whole lower half of your body to continue to relax in its own way, comfortably and easily without effort or struggle and letting it be a pleasant and enjoyable experience. Now, become aware of the midsection of your body, your waistline, abdomen, and your mid-back. Invite that whole midsection of your body to relax in its own way. Now noticing your chest, ribcage, the muscles of your chest around, across, and in between your shoulder blades. Invite your whole chest and ribcage to soften and relax. to release any tension it doesn't need to have, to begin to soften and relax in its own way. As you imagine the trunk of your body relaxing in its own way, let it be a comfortable, pleasant experience. Again, without worrying at all about how deeply you relax, or how you relax more deeply. Simply inviting, allowing, and noticing any relaxation or comfort that you begin to feel in your body. When you are ready, bring your attention to your shoulders and your neck muscles and invite your neck and shoulders to release, let go and relax in their own way, softening, releasing, becoming more comfortable. Imagine the feelings of relaxation going down through your arms and your elbows so comfortable, down through your forearms, releasing and relaxing, inviting your wrists to relax and your hands to be soft and at ease. Let each of your fingers relax one by one your little fingers, ring fingers, middle fingers, index fingers, and thumbs. Invite your scalp and forehead to be soft and at ease. Notice the muscles of your face and jaw and invite your face to be soft and at ease, releasing any tension your face doesn't need to hold, relaxing even more deeply and comfortably. Notice the little muscles around your eyes and invite the little muscles all around your eyes to soften and relax, to release any tension they don't need to hold. Allow that pleasant feeling of relaxation 
to spread all through your face and jaw muscles. Your upper and lower teeth may feel like drifting apart a little bit, and that's all right because you have relaxed. And you might even want to invite your tongue to soften and puddle in your mouth and to relax deeply, to let go and be comfortable. To relax even more deeply, imagine now going to a place that is very beautiful to you, very peaceful and very safe. It may be a place you've actually been in your life or an ideal spot that simply occurs to you now in your imagination. Any spot is good as long as the place where you imagine yourself to be is beautiful to you, peaceful and safe. Imagine now that you're in this place you love to be. This place where it feels so good to be in. If more than one place comes to mind, simply pick the one that attracts you the most. And imagine that you are there right now. Notice what you see. The colors, shapes, things you see. And any sounds you hear. Or perhaps it's very quiet and still. Perhaps you notice an aroma or fragrance, and perhaps you don't. It's perfectly fine if you do or don't. Just notice what the weather is like and what time of day it seems to be. And let yourself relax there. Know that this special place of beauty and peace is here within you at any time, should you wish to relax to renew, to reflect in a more deeply centered and thoughtful way. And you can come here anytime for any purpose you wish. And now, if you choose, let yourself become aware of any feelings you may have about recent events. Simply allow all your feelings to be there without trying to change any of them right now. And with no need to justify them or judge them, just let yourself feel them. even if they are a mixture and even if they change and even if they mix with one another.
Notice each feeling. Name each one that you feel and honor them even if they hurt. Feel them and notice where you feel them in your body. And let them know that they are all valid and okay. They are all normal to feel right now. And now, also feel your strength and determination. And whether you feel a willingness to go on. And whether you feel a desire to do something, however small or large, to help ensure that such things do not occur again. You may not yet know what action will be right for you, but you can be aware of whether or not you have the desire and determination to do something. If you don't, you can rest in your faith and your acceptance. If you do, your action may be internal, like a prayer or a wish. Because much change begins with thoughts, prayers, and visions. Or it may be an external action that involves your family, your friends, your workplace, or your community at large. And you don't need to know exactly what you will do just yet. Again, get in touch with the feelings you were experiencing a little while ago and ask your feelings quietly and internally whether they would be willing to give you their energy to help make this world a better place, a place where terrorism no longer happens. If they answer yes, imagine and feel those feelings changing into a different kind of energy that can be used for healing your pain and for improving your world. And imagine how you might use that energy to make some change that will help. Whether it is in the way you treat yourself or the way you treat others, Whether it's something you will do that involves your family, your friends, your co-workers, or your neighborhood, or a larger aspect of your world. No matter how small or how large the action you can imagine taking, imagine yourself doing something that adds to the safety and the goodness of the world. And notice how that feels. And thank your feelings for the energy and commitment to do this. If you can't yet imagine how you would use this energy, simply invite an image to form that can show you the way. Ask the image, what's the best thing for me to do with this energy? 
and let it respond to you in a way you can understand. Take a moment more to reflect and review what you have experienced and learned during this inner journey. Notice how you feel now and honor the feelings you have. What will you do with the energy that those feelings bring? How does that feel? Take some time to reflect on anything that you want to bring back with you as you return to the outer world. If there's anything you want to act on, you may have a fully formed plan or just the beginning of a direction, or just some new questions and a new way to explore them. But please bring back whatever seems important or helpful to you. And as you begin to bring your attention back to the outer world, bring back the knowledge that you now have a safe place inside that you can go to anytime you want to relax, to learn, or to heal. When you return your attention to the outer world, you may be surprised to find yourself feeling more relaxed and comfortable than you did before. Remember that this quiet, safe place is always within you and you can use this technique anytime you like to return to it and become more comfortable and relaxed. To end this experience for now, all you need to do is simply begin to notice what is going on in the outer world around you. Begin to notice what you hear in the environment and begin to bring your attention back to the outer world as if you are waking up from a very refreshing, very relaxing nap. Just gently bringing your attention back to the outer world around you. As you become gently awake, you haven't really been asleep. You have only been relaxed, but it feels like coming awake. When your attention is all the way back to the outer world around you, all you have to do now is to open your eyes and feel yourself return all the way into your body. Wiggle and stretch your fingers and toes and gently stretch as if you are coming awake from a very refreshing nap. Bring your attention all the way back to the outer world now and look around. Notice what you see and hear coming all the way back, feeling much more refreshed, comfortable, and relaxed than before and ready to help make this world a better place.
This guided imagery program is brought to you by Healthy Roads. Healthy Roads is a subsidiary of American Specialty Health, a national health services organization for complementary health care. This program was authored by Dr. Martin Rossman and Dr. David Bressler, co-directors of the Academy for Guided Imagery.